New this morning, a new study shows Nashville is leading the country when it comes to one aspect of pandemic recovery. Music City beat out every large city in what the study calls the downtown rebound. Our Tony Sloan has looked into the numbers. He joins us live from downtown Nashville. So uh, Tony, they're saying no other city in the country came close to Nashville. Yeah, that's right. Nashville pretty much just sweeped the whole country when it came down to these rankings. Coming as number one with a 100% overall recovery rate. Only one other city ranked above 90%. And this study looked at 25 of the largest cities and took a closer look at the recovery rate since the disruptions of COVID. The average across the country, 79%. So that just shows you how well Nashville is doing compared to others, according to this study. It was presented at the International Downtown Association Conference this week in Chicago. It compares resident, worker, and visitor population in the downtown areas in quarter two of 2019 and the same time in 2023 to compare the differences. It says one of the driving forces for the Music City's recovery rate is all about the tourists. They say it's not at the expense of residential, commercial real estate or other quality of life factors for people who live here. Now, this is also supported by other reports that they publish saying that this is something that really makes a big difference, especially with the vacancy rates. Now, the number of vacancy rates of commercial buildings here in Nashville, 13 percent. Less than similar downtowns in Austin, Charlotte, and Indianapolis. Retail vacancy rates have been below 4% for five years. And residential vacancy rates have a five-year streak at 10% or less, even with the delivery of record numbers of new homes. City leaders say they hope to continue going strong and keeping Nashville at the top as it continues to grow. I'll send it back to you in the studio. Yeah, I don't think anyone who spends time downtown is surprised by these numbers. Tony, thanks so much.